Welcome to Peep This Out Reviews with Ian K. Stay frosty. What's going on everybody and welcome back to another high quality foodie feature for you here on the channel. We're this time I'm over at McDonald's because it looks like they're test marketing a brand new McFlurry that just happens to have one of my favorite snack foods in it. That's right, and you already know what it is. Feast your eyes on the chocolate caramel pretzel McFlurry, and it's already beginning to melt, guys, but as you can see, there is a very decent amount of toppings on the inside of this one, especially on that dome. You can see it right there. All right, so what this is exactly is their famous vanilla soft serve that's blended with chocolate and caramel along with crushed pretzel pieces. So obviously the salty goodness I'm sure this is going to have is going to go very nicely with the caramel. But guys, it looks very refreshing, and on a hot day, I'm definitely looking to get into this. Yes, sir, some definitely nice chunks of pretzel action that you can see on the very top there, guys. And even though it's super steamy outside right now, this is still kind of holding its own, even though it is kind of melting, obviously. But even still, very excited to see how this is going to go with pretzel. Really, there's a lot in here, too, guys. As you can see, that classic vanilla soft serve action, nice chunky pieces of pretzel, and naturally with chocolate and caramel. How bad could this really be? Let's give it a shot. This is the currently in-test chocolatey caramel pretzel McFlurry here at McDonald's. Let's do it. Mmm, that is working. The chocolate and the pretzels alone. Mmm, texturally, obviously, you've got the crunch, you've got the smoothness of the actual ice cream itself. Wow, that is really tasty. The only downside about this right now is everything is kind of sinking to the bottom, but as you guys can see, this is super refreshing. The chunks of pretzel in this, along with the chocolate and caramel, very lovely situation. Mmm, cold and crunchy and savory and salty because of that. That's really tasty. Let me see if I can go a little further down here and pull up some more of the good stuff. Kind of missing this around, but really, really nice. I'm not really a super fan of caramel, but mixing it with chocolate, when they say chocolatey in the title, it absolutely is, guys. There's a lot of chocolate in this, and of course, dovetailing right into the pretzel action. Pretty nice. Mmm. Yeah. You know, and just thinking about the name of this chocolatey caramel pretzel McFlurry, I can't help that if this does go national, which I'm assuming it's going to because the flavors are pretty awesome with this, I'm sure it's going to be like a shortened name. And honestly, even chocolatey pretzel McFlurry or the pretzel McFlurry would be perfectly fine. Back in the day, they had the Oreo Mint McFlurry, which actually became the Oreo Shamrock McFlurry. And of course, I reviewed that one there. You're probably seeing it popping up on your screen here right now. But this, I got to say, this works pretty nicely, guys. And again, there's a fairly decent amount of chunky goodness even though this is really beginning to melt there. I'm trying to show you as much as I can, but a very lovely situation all across the board flavorized this. It's pretty nice. Mm. Yeah, that's some pretty tasty stuff. And obviously when you have chocolate covered pretzels, which is kind of the vibe I'm getting with that there, of course I'm gonna like that along with the vanilla soft serve. But also for you salted caramel heads out there, you're getting a combination of that as well. So it's a little bit different with almost every bite. If you can get everything all in one like I was doing there, it's a beautiful combination. All the flavors are on point and naturally it's elevated in sweetness, but even still, I love the crunchiness of it. The textural difference compared to the ice cream is awesome. And naturally with the saltiness of the pretzels, definitely a lovely situation. So with that said, I'm gonna to have to give this currently in test chocolatey caramel pretzel McFlurry here at McDonald's a pretty rock solid eight out of 10. Guys, it's a pretty flavorful McFlurry either way because of what it's based off of. Naturally that vanilla soft serve is banging. Mixing it with chocolate and caramel, of course, is gonna be primo. Once you throw in those pieces of pretzel, that's where things come alive with this one. So I'm really hoping they just call this the pretzel McFlurry or the chocolatey pretzel McFlurry. It really is pretty tasty. And again, like I said, elevated in sweetness, but the flavor's on point. All right, so I gotta ask you, if you're a fan of either chocolate, caramel, and maybe salted, crunchy pretzels, or heck, maybe even all of the above, how excited are you to give this one a shot? Is this something that you'd like to see go national at McDonald's? Drop some comments down below. Let me know of your thoughts on this particular one. And which do you think would go better by itself? Chocolate and pretzels alone, or caramel and pretzels with that? Maybe they're gonna split this one off, who knows? Drop those comments down below, and definitely let me know. And with that, this is Ian K closing out another high quality foodie feature for you here on Peep This Out Reviews, bringing you brand new content every single week here on my channel. So I stay tuned for that next review coming real soon. In the meantime, stay frosty. You know, now that I think about it, if this does go national, I think they should actually call it just chocolatey pretzel McFlurry because just thinking about this actually after the experience of having it, the caramel is more of the accent. It's not the main thing in this naturally. The chocolate is along with the pretzels. So just my two cents, McDonald's, just my two cents. All right, guys, until next time, I'll talk to you soon. Hey, thanks for checking out another one of my reviews. But just in case you didn't see the one before this one, you can find it right up over here, along with what I think YouTube's gonna recommend for you to check out as well. As always, I think you'll find something to like in both of them, and I'll definitely catch you in the next one. See ya.